go-getter, a no-regretter. And lucky you, today you're a jet setter. So welcome aboard the Cirrus Aircraft Vision Jet, the world's first single-engine personal jet. Before we fly, let's pause for a few pre-flight safety tips. And if you ever need to review this safety info, treat yourself to the Vision Jet safety card in your seat back pocket. Here we go. There are two exits on the Vision Jet, the main cabin door and the emergency egress window. To open the clamshell cabin door, press and hold the button while rotating the handle upwards and push the upper shell out. For the bottom, rotate the handle up and lower the door as the stairs unfold. In the unlikely event you need to make an emergency exit and the cabin door won't open, rotate the emergency egress handle down to release the latches. Then set the window aside and evacuate as required. Once you're settled in, buckle up just like you would in a car. Enough said! To unbuckle, well, you get the idea. Just promise me you'll stay seated with your seatbelt fastened anytime the airplane is moving. What I can promise you is that there will be no smoking at any time on this flight. But in the rare case that smoke was ever present in the cabin, remember that a fire extinguisher is installed right here. If we ever lost cabin pressure, oxygen masks will automatically drop from the ceiling. Place the mask around your nose and mouth and use the strap to secure it around your head. And breathe normally. Secure your own mask before assisting others. If they don't automatically deploy, no big deal. Simply remove the magnetic cover and follow the friendly cartoon by pulling one string to drop the mask and one more string to pop the pin and start the flow of oxygen. If you're in the front seat and need oxygen, pinch and hold the two red tabs to release the mask and inflate the head straps. Next, lower the straps over your head, position the mask in front of your nose and mouth, and release the tabs to secure the straps. Again, breathe normally. <sighs> Finally, here's the highlight of this Vision Jet's total safety system. See that big red button on the ceiling? That's Safe Return, the Vision Jet's emergency auto land system. If the pilot was ever incapacitated and couldn't land, you can push that button and the Vision Jet will enter Safe Return mode by selecting a safe airport, landing, and coming to a full stop, all by itself. I know, wow. After you push that button, look to the big screens in the cockpit. They'll tell you what to do next. And remember that you can reference the passenger briefing card at any time to learn more about Safe Return. In the incredibly rare situation where Safe Return or the pilot were unable to assist, you can always turn to your ultimate backup, the Cirrus Airframe Parachute System, CAPS. With your seatbelt firmly fastened, pull the red CAPS handle downward in a steady chin-up pulling motion with about 45 pounds of force. The autopilot will temporarily assume control of the vision jet, and a huge parachute will inflate above the airplane and lower us safely to the ground. But remember, you'd only need to use either safety system if the pilot was unable to land the plane for some reason, which is not likely. This flight is ready to go, and now you are too. From here on out, you're living the Cirrus life at jet speed. So ready, jet set, and let's go.